Okay. Oh, hello, 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 Virgo. How are you doing? This is Momo's. Okay, I'm doing um, an oracle reading for you guys where I go more into depth. You get more advice. Like, share, hit the notification button to be notified when I post a video, you guys. New viewers, subscribe. I love to have you as a subscriber. Sit back, get the clarity you need, enjoy the reading. All right. Okay. Again, subscribe. I'd love to have you as subscribers, okay? And like, share. Okay, so here we go, Virgos. We're going to go into your reading. Virgos energy. What's the advice you have for Virgos? Virgos energy. What advice do you have for Virgos energy, please? Show me advice you have for Virgos energies, please. Show me advice you have for Virgos energies, please. Thank you. Show me advice that you have for Virgo's energy. Virgo's energy. Virgo's energy, please. Two. Two more cards, please. Virgo's energy. Okay. Wow, you got more than that. Cards flew out. Something may be coming in very fast. Or things may be going very fast for you guys in a certain situation. Okay, we have self-employment here. You're a born entrepreneur and your business is surrounded by magical opportunities, okay? Have faith. There's a situation you need to have faith in. Your prayers are manifesting. Remain positive and follow your guidance, Virgo. Worthiness. You are worthy of all things. Know that you deserve to receive good in all ways. I think Taurus got that as well. If you want to go look at the Taurus reading, you may. Set your sights higher. Set your sights higher. Okay? Increase your standards and expect more for yourself. Don't settle. Don't settle for less. Know your worth. Okay? Bless change. Bless change. A major life change brings you great blessings. So you have blessings coming to you that's going to change your life. All right, for the better. So let's go deeper and clarify these cards. Self-employment. Four voices. There's healing here. You're a born entrepreneur and your business is surrounded by magical opportunities. Use your intuition to help guide you. Pray to your higher power to give you that spiritual guidance you need concerning this business that you're, um, you're growing, that you're manifesting, okay? Okay, self-employment concerning Virgo's energy. Self-employment concerning Virgo's energy, please. Self-employment. Yeah, relax your mind as well. You know, rest as well. Don't allow yourself to be stressed. Because you need your mind in this situation where you're having your own business, you know. It could take its mental toll on you. So you're needing to get a lot of rest as well. Um, use of voices. This is the King of Swords. Okay. Be honest. Um, speak the truth to people concerning your business. People are wanting to hear the truth concerning your business. Okay. So maybe it's products you're selling. Be truthful about whatever it is you're selling. All right. Stand your ground as well. In situations, because it may be a lot of competition where you're going to have to fight to, to get ahead in this employment, self-employment. You may have to do a lot of speaking ventures, so you need a lot of rest. You may have to travel and do a lot of speaking ventures as well concerning your business. The hair fund is here, okay? Um, again, use spiritual guidance as well, okay? Um Get some counseling. Talk to somebody that's professional um, that has expertise in your field, okay? So it's okay to get some help. It's okay to ask for help. Don't be too proud to ask for help, okay? So let your pride down. Um, have faith. Moving on. Have faith. Clarify have faith in Virgo's energy, please. Justice. Okay, 
Have faith that you will get the justice and victory in this situation, okay? It's yours. You won in this situation. Some of you could be going through a separation, a divorce, or some type of legal issue, a um, court issue you could be going through. Have faith that you will win, okay? Victory is on your side. Just believe it. You have to believe it. Okay, three of inspirations, okay? Somebody could have turned their back on you, thinking there's something better out there, or there's a situation you need to turn your back on and believe, have faith that there's something better for you out there, okay? Because you may be having a fear, fear of separating yourself from a situation or you need to separate yourself from. Ace of Voices is here. Clarity. Get clarity from a higher power. Be honest. Okay, be honest with yourself, all right? And you will be able to move forward successfully in this situation. You will get the success. You will get the victory. Um, the fool card is here. Yeah, take that leap, okay? But allow your higher power to give you the clarity on which way to take that leap, okay? Or when to take that leap, okay? Before you take it, eight of cups is here. Yeah, there's a situation you're walking away from. Get the clarity from a higher power on which way to go and how to go about doing it, all right? But you're going to get the victory. You just have to believe you have faith, you know? Um, worthiness is here. Clarify worthiness and Virgo's energy. Okay. It could be somebody walking. I'm going to go back here. Some of you, it could be somebody leaving a situation coming towards you, Okay. It could be a uh, cancer energy, a water sign energy coming towards you. They're walking away from another situation coming towards you. That's for some of you, not all. Okay, worthiness is here. Know that you deserve to receive good in all ways. Eight of voices. The eight of swords is here. Okay, so you're feeling down, maybe. You're feeling insecure, defeated, Um. You're having fear. You're not very confident. And you're allowing yourself to be stuck in a cycle that you need to end, okay? Believe in yourself. Know that you're worthy, okay, of all things. All things you can have. You can have whatever it is you want. You just have to believe. You have that faith, okay? And there's a, you're not stuck. Allow yourself to move forward in this cycle and embark on your new beginning, Virgo. Five of Voices is here. Five of Swords. Yeah, you're feeling defeated. You're, you're not defeated. Look at this. You're blessed. Look at this olive branch up here. You're blessed with stability. Everything you have, you have it. Okay? But it's just a mental fear you're having here. Of, you know, insecurities is holding you back from moving forward in the situation. And in a cycle that you need to end. Virgo's energy. Concerning worthiness. Okay, the page of voices is here. Page of swords. Research, investigate to help you push yourself forward. There's something you need to investigate. And you're going to find out some things. And it's going to push you forward out of this cycle. Okay? Okay, use your wisdom. Use your spiritual guidance as well in this situation. Okay? You have a lot of wisdom for your age. You could be a young person. Pisces energy here. Um, clarify worthiness. I'm going to throw one more card on worthiness. Um, there could be a friendship you have with someone, a friend to help you in this situation as well. Ten of voices. Okay. Betrayal is here. Somebody's betraying you. Somebody you may think is a friend to you, their backs have been betraying you, and you need to end the cycle, move forward out of this situation. Hangman, Muse, Pisces energy, strong Pisces here. Yeah. And you're just stuck. You're not moving from this situation. You're allowing yourself to be stuck with this betrayal, with this person that's betraying you. Somebody's doing you wrong. You need to, you're allowing yourself to be stuck here. Know your words. Okay, moving on. Um, set your sights higher. Clarify, set your sights higher. Clarify, set your sights higher in um, Virgo's energy, please. Okay, the nine of emotions, the nine of cups here. 
Yeah. Increase your standards and expect more for yourself. Don't settle. Okay, it could be somebody you're settling for, a water sign. It could be a cancer energy, Pisces, or it could be any of the signs. But the nine emotions, you see a cancer, but it could be a Pisces or a Scorpio energy you're dealing with. So this water sign energy has a lot of other op options that they're dealing with behind your back. And they're just holding on to you, but they're paying all these other options attention. Okay, so that's what you're needing to know. You need to set your sights higher. Um, Virgo's energy. Okay. Um, the wheel is here. Yeah, you need to end the cycle. The wheel is here. Um, this person may get their due karma for doing whatever they're doing behind your back. Um, the wheel is in your favor at this time. Um, Ace of Inspirations. The wheel is in your favor. The gift is gifting you. A new beginning, a passionate new beginning. Okay, there may be a fire sign that wants a new beginning with you and you're being gifted this person when they come in. Okay, or this is a business. This could be concerning a business, a passionate new beginning and whatever you're creating, some type of business. But it's, it's a new beginning here for you, a fiery, passionate new beginning that you're being gifted. Okay, but you got to set your sights higher because there's, a, well, this could be a victory for you as well. If this isn't a water sign you're dealing with, this could be just a victory for you. All right? If it's a water sign you're dealing with, they're dealing with a lot of other options. They're stubborn, selfish, and there's something better for you. A fire sign energy. There's a passion new beginning that awaits you. Okay? Um, moving on. Bless changes. Virgo's energy. Bless changes for Virgo's energy. Okay, so, all right. So, bless change. A major life change brings you great blessings. So, there's a loss here. You're going to feel a loss in a situation, but this is also a blessing for you. This is going to be a big change for you, but it's a blessing in disguise, okay? But you're going to feel at a loss. Um, my condolences, maybe there's a passing that may take place. It may not have happened yet, okay? But there's a loss here, some type of loss. It could be a separation of a marriage, okay? A separ if, if you're not married, you could be separated with, from somebody that you love dearly. But there's a loss here. But it's a big blessing in disguise, whoever I'm speaking to, all right? It's going to be a lot of pain and tears. But it's a blessing in disguise, um, Virgo. Okay, Virgo, bless changes. The devil is here. Yeah, this was a toxic situation. Okay, and it could have been an ending. The devil is here. This person could have had some type of addictions. Maybe you lost this person through some type of addiction. Maybe they drank a lot. Maybe it was a sexual addiction they had. And maybe they got some type of illness where it caused this person to lose their life or something of that nature. Um, Somebody could have committed suicide. I don't I'm just that just I'm hearing Bakersfield as well. I don't know why I heard Bakersfield, but I heard Bakersfield. Something about Bakersfield. Six of Voices is here. But you're gonna get a windfall of money out of this situation. Balance is gonna come back to your life. You gonna get a windfall of money. Six of Swords, you're gonna oh, six of swords. This is moving to better waters. But I'm saying money, so you may get some money out of this. I'm not seeing the pinnacles yet. But you are going to move to better waters. You're going to be released from a toxic situation. Okay. However you go through this loss, it's going to get you out of a toxic situation. Okay. And you're going to move to better waters. Okay. Virgo's energy. However this takes place. Queen of materials. There you go. You're going to be stable. You're going to get some type of money out of this. Queen of pentacles. You're going to be very stable. Strong, you're gonna be. You're not gonna need anybody. Independent, you're gonna be of whatever loss you're gonna have. You're gonna be very stable, secure, stability wise. You're gonna be very strong, stability wise. You're not gonna be in any financial struggles or anything due to this separation, this loss. Okay, so if it's a passing of someone, which my condolences to you, you there, you're gonna be left some money. You're gonna be very stable. 
Okay, if it's a separation, you're going to get money from the separation and you're going to be very stable. Okay, you're going to be able to support yourself. In other words, page of inspirations is here. Page of wands. So there's some communication going to be coming in to you. This is going to be a. It could be a fire sign after this separation, after this loss, it's going to come into you wanting to with some information, with some communication. Concerning a new beginning of growth. So you're going to get some communication coming in to you. Or it's going to be concerning this stability. That you're going to embark on a new beginning of growth. Or you're going to have all kind of ideas of a new beginning of growth. Because you're going to be so stable. You're going to be able to do whatever you want to do. But that's what I have for you, Virgo. Um, beautiful reading. I'm out. I love you guys. Subscribe. I hope you gain the clarity you needed from... Some advice from this reading. Again, I love you guys. I'm out.